Hey, what is up guys? Corson Drax here. Welcome back to another video. In this episode, I am going to be reviewing the Justice League Cyborg Funko Pop. Alright, so we're gonna get this out of the box. Uh, this is gonna be Cyborg from the Justice League. Which, it's kind of a new movie, not really. I don't know how to call it, I'll say it's semi-new, but anyways, we're gonna get him out. Alright, here he is. So, let's take a look. Alright, so he's got the standard human Funko eye, and then over here he's got his robotic eye, which is basically the whole cyborg eye, it's all red. You can see uh, some of his skin is exposed, like, cause if you don't know the story, most of his body got destroyed. And that's why he wears, like, the robotic suit, because they had to replace his, his dad, I think, had to replace basically some of his, like, uh, most of his body with robotic parts, because the majority of his body was destroyed. But you see, this right here is still, there's still some left over from his human body. But, yeah, the hair looks pretty well designed, because his hair's not anything too fancy, it's basically just, like, slimmed down. Alright, um... Oh wow, they put a lot of work into this, like, if you take a look at, like, the, um, uh, basically the steel, uh, chest plate or whatever, like, they did a lot of work into just this tiny figure. Like, right here or whatever, they've got, like, the, um, I don't know what you call that, but, uh, right here, like, past, like, the red line, look at this. Like, look at all the robotic details just in that one part. And yeah, the, see the arms... Yep, arms are well designed. Like, wow, they put- This might be the most, like, detailed Funko Pop I've reviewed. I mean, look at this. Like, there's so much detail. Like, you can see all the robotic parts sticking out. Alright, so, for the legs... Yep, same thing. Really cool. You can see some gears over there on both sides. Uh, the feet look really cool. Actually, it kind of looks like camel feet. I don't know if you guys see that, but, like, it doesn't kind of look like camel feet. I don't know. Alright, let's check out the back. Steel helmet, looks pretty cool. The back has more design than the front, I think. Well, besides, like, the red line. Like, look at this, though. Like, you can see all the steel, like, uh, what do you call them? I don't know what you call those, but, like, I'll just call them, like, steel lines. I don't know. You can see, like, the steel lines going through here. Uh, yeah, you got some bolts. Uh, what else we got? Uh, steel pants look mm, pretty decent. I like the front better, though, because you can see, like, the gears, and I think it has more detail. But, yeah, let's see in here. Yeah, in here you got, like, the darker steel. Because, like, this is basically all just, like, um, how do you put it, like, Basically, like, the shiny light steel, but then under here, I, I mean, or maybe it's because, wait, no, never mind. But yeah, this is basically, like, the darker steel, uh, how do you call them? I don't know what you call this. Like, can anyone in the comments tell me? I don't know what you call, like, steel. Are they bars? I don't know what they are. Is it a bit, okay, I don't know, like, steel shaping? I don't know. But yeah, this Funko Pop has a lot of good design built into it. I would definitely recommend it. Uh, yeah, I'd probably give it a, um... Probably like a 5 out of 5. Yeah, like I really like this. It has a lot of cool detail and design in it. It's a really cool figure to have. But uh, yeah. So, hope you enjoyed the review and uh, stuff. I hope you enjoyed my review for the Justice League Cyborg Funko Pop. If you enjoyed, please leave a like, comment, subscribe. And uh, yeah, I will see you in the next video. Goodbye.